Of late, social media has been awash with the rumors of how Inspector of Police Martin Okothochola has been very ill and hospitalized. Rumors that were later dispelled by the spokesperson of the Uganda Police. Today, the IGP made his first public appearance in a while at the police headquarters in Naguru, where he went to launch the annual general meeting for the Directorate of Health Services. While appearing before the Parliamentary Committee on Defense, the Director of Health Services in the Uganda Police, Dr. Moses Vyaruhanga, revealed to members of the committee that IGP was facing some bit of illness. However, the appearance of the IGP today is a confirmation that he is indeed not bedridden. Dr. Vyaruhanga urged the public to maintain discipline and not to spread baseless rumors. He categorically stated that every person has his or her own management style. But uh, what I think the people were used to the previous management style of the former Inspector General of Police, General Kali Kayola, where he was almost all the time in the field. Hmm? Now with this new leadership, for him his style is different. He calls us for meetings, he gives us his instructions, we discuss, then he says, Director Health Services will do this, Director CID will do this, Logistics will do this. Then he goes on to other activities. The IGP, who has been away from the spotlight, also missed the burial of his deputy, the late Paul Cage, last month with rumors pointing to sickness. While launching the annual general meeting, Dr. Vyaruhanga presented challenges and achievements which later the IGP responded to. Lack of a police-owned referral hospital. But good enough, sir, you gave me a chance sometime back to present to PAC a concept which was approved and it is one of the major priorities of police in this financial year. We take serious note of the challenges faced in the execution of your duties, but promise that we shall continue putting in place measures to ensure that you have the necessary protective equipment needed to perform your tasks, remain safe and stay alive. Flavian Nkuze, CTV, PM Edition.